so you've downloaded your Ta'agra font, but you aren't ready to use it just yet. Since Ta'agra's writing system is so different from English's, we'll have to change some settings in any program we use. I'll be covering Microsoft Word, Adobe Photoshop, and Illustrator, since unfortunately many other programs don't support the advanced font features that Ta'agra relies on. To work in Microsoft Word, you'll want to start off by typing some test letters in the Ta'agra font, highlighting them, and then right-clicking on that selection. From this list, select Font, and it should bring up a window like this. Go to the Advanced tab, up at the top, and here's where we'll make three key changes. You'll need to check both boxes, labeled Kerning for Fonts, and Use Contextual Alternates. Lastly, in the drop-down box for Ligatures, select All. Now, as you're typing in Microsoft Word, you may notice that certain symbols tend to change back to the default font. These symbols include double quotes and the apostrophe. So I've included alternate keys in this font that can be used in this case, with the left and right arrows being the same as beginning and end quotes, and the hyphen being the same as the apostrophe. Since both of these programs are Adobe products, they work pretty similarly. You'll want to start off with some starter text in the Ta'agra font. In Photoshop, if the character window is not already visible, go to the Window tab and select Character. In Illustrator, if the Open Type window is not visible, go to the Window tab and under Type, select Open Type. With your sample text selected, go to the previously open window and ensure that the first two buttons in the bottom list are selected, the ones that look like FI and a cursive O. In the kerning settings, represented by a V slash A, set the value to zero. Now you're all set to get creating. Feel free to share your Ta'agra related projects on the Ta'agra Project Discord server linked in the description, and check out ta'agra.com to learn more about the language itself. Now, if you're wondering if some other program can use Ta'agra's functionalities, try Googling if that program supports open type contextual alternates. And if it does, there should be other tutorials out there to help. If you find a program you think we should add to our tutorials, or if you find a bug in the font, please send an email to ko.ahib at gmail.com.